The global economy is gradually gaining momentum, but recovery is happening at very different speeds worldwide. The United States and Japan are growing at a stronger pace than the Euro area, while large emerging economies are seeing a moderate upswing. Business confidence is rising in the United States, flat in Japan and falling in Europe. Similar trends are seen in labor markets, with unemployment edging downward in the U.S., but rising in Europe. The outlook looks encouraging for the U.S. economy, where growth is driven increasingly by private sector demand. Japan needs to continue in its fiscal consolidation and implement structural reforms to boost growth. The emerging economies are growing at healthy paces. The euro area remains the single most serious risk to the global economy, and recent events have increased that risk. In the euro area, there must be a major rebalancing. In the south, countries have to adjust their competitiveness. In the north, healthier economies have to boost domestic demand, including to higher wages. Everybody must do something. At the European level, several actions can be taken. The firewall has been strengthened. It could be further enhanced to cope with contagion if need be. The single market can deliver much more growth. It should be further boosted. The European Investment Bank can fund important infrastructure projects to boost demand. Last but not least, the European Central Bank can enhance the use of its balance sheet and lower its interest rate.